Some victims said they received distress calls that fire engulfed the house at 4 a.m. They said before they arrived, the inferno consumed goods and property and nothing could be salvaged. According to the victims, men of the state fire service arrived late despite smoke was still billowing. They appeared to kind-hearted individuals, corporate organizations and the state government to come to their aid. When I got here around 2 a.m., I opened my shop. There was nothing unusual about this place. Everywhere was calm. Around 4 a.m., somebody said they saw fire emanating from the back of my shop. What I have here are London goods, brand new children and ladies. Italian shoes, brand new, all gone. I lost over 50 million naira here. I surprised that they called me around 4 o'clock when they bring light. They said that the, light, the house got fire. My document or my land document or my vehicle document, all miss. It was this very early morning, I, was, I received a call from my elder sister that the shop before my own is burning and it's severe that I should bring key. Before I could navigate to this place, I think it was already to five. Some people and my family helped me to break, try to stop it, in, but... They were unable because the fire uh, density was really high. So before you could know everything, just gone down, worth of millions. At the time of this report, the cause of the inferno is yet to be ascertained. William Siama, ITV News.